first, it's a UFC women's flyweight division matchup. well-rounded fighters, DC, that we have in this division. A true mixed martial artist. Her first martial art was MMA. That certainly helps. Yes, she's a new breed of fighter. A fighter that, as a young girl, she was brought into a gym. And in that gym, she told the coaches, I don't want to wrestle. I don't want to do jiu-jitsu. I don't want to kickbox and box. I want to do it all. Right. Is there an MMA class for my daughter to take part in? She did that from day one, and you see all that development over the course of a lifetime has led her to the octagon, where she is already making her impact. Yeah, she said, I didn't want to get to the UFC until I was 100% comfortable in every situation. So far, so good for her. She's got a big one in front of her here tonight. Well, she's one of the more exciting fighters in this or any division and really came into the UFC with some legitimate striking credentials, and she's put those to good use in the big show. And that's why everybody was so excited about her UFC debut. They understood that they were about to witness something truly special. A striker, a fighter with an ability to finish fights with her legs, with her hands, with her elbows, with her knees. There was nothing, no tool at her disposal that she would not use. She was going to use everything gifted to her, and she has done that, and that's why her performances have been so great in the UFC. Yeah, she does not discriminate. She is a true tried and tested eight-point striker, so try to put on a striking clinic here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the sold out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. <laughs> Flyweight division. It's for the first fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist holding professional record of 16 wins, five losses. She stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of Glendale, Arizona, USA, Lauren Murphy. And now it's your your opponent. Fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a kickboxer, making a professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet three inches tall, weighing in at 121 pounds. Fighting out of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, the chosen one. All right, get to the reason lock me. I want you to be my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. A nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back to your corners, come out fighting. She wanted to kick right under that right elbow. Murphy's shot is blocked. Oh, how is she standing? Brutal knee to the body. Oh! Big knee to the body! Murphy gets caught with that punch. And there comes, whoa! She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed and it looks like she's gonna finish this fight. to the body. Three minutes to go, round one. All right, so the fighters are in the clinch again, DC. I get tired just watching these situations. It's exhausting. This is a position where you are constantly draining at the gas tank of your opponent. Nice. Oh, nice. 
Nice leg kick by him there, DC. She disguises it really well, and when she gets the right moment, she drives her shin right into her opponent's thigh. She missed with that jab. And she caught the kick. And they separate. Oh, perfect head kick there. Oh, nice right in. Oh, man, he's a hard. We got to fight, folks. Oh, big left hook there. Just misses there with the left. Well, now she's really starting to time her opponent. Beautiful punch lands there shortly after she caught the left. Straight punch lands. That was a thudding leg kick. Great tempo to her striking game tonight. She is staying busy in a nice series of punches again there. She's in a great flow state. The hands are flowing, the head movement's going. She's doing a fantastic job. You love that flow state. I love it. Well, she whiffs on the straight right hand. Nice loop of punch. Well, she gets hit by that leg kick, so maybe that one gets her attention. a big shot to the head. I cannot believe she's still standing. Well, a punch like that would have felled lesser women, but she survives and gets to fight another round. She's as tough as they come. She's sitting on her bench right now telling her coaches, I'm good. I'm ready to go. That was just a moment. I'm still going to get the victory. I believe she has to change something. She cannot continue to do the same thing and expect a different result. Okay, ready? Round two? You ready? All right, round two. All right, so there's that kick to the leg, and you can be sure she's going to go back to the well with that. She's beating up that lead leg, dominating it, and slowing down her opponent. Look for her to continue doing that same thing. She's really starting to put together some significant body shots here, attacking both sides now. Big punch land. Ooh. Oh, big knee there. Let's get some offense. Let's get going. An uppercut landed. Well, she said in these situations she had to protect her head, and defensively she has done an outstanding job of that. She could not do it any better up to this point. Stuffs the takedown shot there. How good is her takedown dude? Nice body kick. Nice punch lands over the top. She's starting to put together some significant body work here, and these are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Just out of range with that right hand. of her size advantage in this one. Murphy gets stung by that leg kick. And she lands a punch there. We'll see if she can start to turn these singular strikes into combinations now. She's gonna have to find something to follow that big strike that she's landing over and over again. Murphy gets the double leg kick down. The best entry, I think, in terms of the offensive wrestling and the takedown attempts finally gets her opponent down for the first time tonight. It feels like she gave up on getting the takedown, so it started to flow more naturally. She threw her entire body into that massive uppercut, and she is seeing the rewards of her hard work. Well, she was a little bit hesitant in round one, but she has certainly picked up the pace here in this second round. It took her a while to find her range. She's in a strong striking rhythm now. Oh, beautiful connection by her on that punch. She's so fast when she throws. It's a beautiful fast foot jab with beating. 
and they set. Oh, she landed a big one the body. So there's the end of the round. She didn't force the finish after getting that knockdown with the head kick, but was very close to getting the job done there for good in that round. She's so patient. She's never going to overextend herself. She's never going to rush. She's never going to force anything. She will always stay exactly in her pocket. She will stay exactly in her rhythm. She believes that eventually the finish will come. All right, are you ready? You ready? Third round underway. Well, how impressive is this young woman? High volume of strikes in the previous round and picking up exactly where she left off here and not really showing any signs of slowing down. She looks like she could go 10 hard fives tonight if need be. And she connects with a punch there. We'll see if she can follow it up now. She's been landing at a super high rate. She's in a great flow right now. And she misses with the left punch there. Oh, that's a good knee to the body, exactly what she needed. Going to the body now with the kick. That one is blocked, though, by Murphy. All right, so she goes to the kick and promptly lands. Nicely done there. She has done that over and over again. Every time she throws it, it's landed. Murphy's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Oh! 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 Back to the feet. Well, how urgent is this fighter down the stretch? She is really lighting her up now. She found her range in the middle of this fight and she is making up for lost time. Oh, she lands a massive knee to the head. Murphy's uppercut to the head. That one, though, blocked by the defense. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Stuff the takedown, no problem. Big kick lands. Powerful leg kick lands. What a punch. Oh, nice leg kick by her. Nice there, DC, and now her opponent. Maybe seeing stars. And just like that, the fight is over. Oh! Not sure she could have drawn it up much better. Just a beautiful strike to end the fight for her opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that flush shot coming. So this is exactly the way she drew it up. She told us during fight week that she had to find a way to finish this fight to send a message to the rest of this division. Message sent. And there she is after the massive knockout. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Bruce Buffer Ladies inside the octagon with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, call the stop to this contest at three minutes, 43 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, the chosen one. Well, there she 